you're thinking, Chris, why would you decorate a master bathroom? Well, you know what? What if you have a party? What if you have family visiting? What they usually do is they walk them toward your home, right? A lot of times they're gonna go in the master bath or make it a reason why they're gonna come in the master bath. Have fun with it, not only for your guests, but for yourself. For example, every year I do something different to my bathtub. Last year what I did is I filled it up with water and I floated white snow, which you can put, it's kind of like chewed up plastic that you can find in bags at a craft store. So I floated that and I took floating votive candles and floated that along with it and lit them during my party. It looked awesome. This year, of course, I had to outdo myself. So I had all these glass ornaments left over. So all I did was float them on top of the water. They don't sink and it looks great. Then don't forget about around your bathtub. All I did was take these artificial pine trees and then just made great big clusters of ornaments and wired them to the bottom of the trees so it looks like they're just exploding with color. Then added some tillandsias. These are the gray looking plant, which is are fake, so they're not real, but that helps add a little organic feel to it. And then of course, three candles in the row because my magic number is always three. And now I have a beautiful look that I can enjoy besides just my guests. The only thing I miss is taking a bath. Well, I guess I'll have to wait until January. You're watching today's home and I'm Chris Olson.